this looks like a great meal, right? Some steak, eggs, butter, even my favorite, some sardines. But there's one problem with this. This is who's eating this. Yeah, unless you look like this, this is not what your plate should look like on a ketogenic diet. Here's why. The most common misconception about people who go keto or carnivore is that they can eat all the meat and protein they can possibly eat. Even though I may have fed this misconception in the past, it's not true. The gluttony phase is a period of fat adaption where your body is switching from a carb-based metabolism to a fat-based metabolism. And during that time, you can eat quite a lot. Yes, eat as much as you want. But about six or eight weeks into this, you must move on to the next step. Calories do matter on the ketogenic diet, but not in the way you might think. The two broad mantras for weight loss have always been to restrict the energy intake or to burn more calories. You've probably heard this, eat less, move more, but it's actually more complicated than this. If you track calories on a keto or carnivore diet, many of my patients find that they're eating more calories than they were on the standard American diet, but they're losing weight. That sounds crazy. They're eating more, moving about the same, but losing weight. This is because that fat-based eating really boosts their metabolism by shifting their endocrine hormones from a very sickly level to a much more normal level. That boost in hormones burns more calories even while they're at rest. But this metabolic advantage that you get in a fat-based metabolism does not last forever. Eventually, your body adapts. And that's when you need to reduce your intake. The second reason this meal isn't a good idea for weight loss is protein. Protein is not for energy. Protein is for protein synthesis, like in your muscles and cartilage and bones. Building those proteins comes from eating proteins. Don't get me wrong, you need protein and you should not think of keto as a low protein diet. But with 183 grams of protein in a single meal, you're overdoing it. And most sedentary people, don't use that much protein. But if you're trying to build muscle and you're eating a plate like this, you better be stressing those muscles enough to need this much protein in repair. Do you wonder if that carnivore diet is right for you? I have an important lesson that you should think about first.